hats have arrived, um, which I'm really excited about. I think they look pretty fucking cool. It's nicely embroidered there. They're on Beachfield snapbacks, and um, they look fucking dope. I'm gonna be doing a competition. I'm gonna be selling a couple if anyone wants to buy them. And uh, but if you if you if you're interested in one, just shoot me a DM on um, Instagram, or you can. <clears throat> email me at holysmoke at gmail.com um, also let me show you something really cool uh, who else has got fucking cigar Christmas tree decorations hey that's my fucking style I got Bolivar I got Partagus I got all of them okay and also I wanted to do a uh, yeah, wait. Unboxing, cause um, cause I am. Um, I was speaking with uh, one uh, good man, Alex. Alex on the channel. Thank you for this, bro. Uh, he sent me some post, and I wanted to show you guys this, cause uh, very kind of him. Uh, we've actually been chatting a bit uh, on email. Alex sent me a couple of emails. And um, he sent me a few non-Cubans to try because obviously I'm not a non-Cuban connoisseur. So I'm looking forward to these. So what we got? A Quorum Natural Double Gordo, which is obviously this motherfucker. And these are these are big cigars, man. These are not small. Uh, Quorum Natural Double Gordo. A Padrone 5000 Natural, which uh, is obviously that. Another Hubbard there. Uh, uh, a Punch Rare Cujo, ooh, Corojo El Double, which is there. Corojo. I've never smoked, I've smoked Punch, but not non Cuban Punch. I have smoked a uh, Quorum before, but only a little, a little one. Uh, and then a H. Chapman Vintage Cameroon. Obviously, I smoked Vin H. Chapman's before, but again, never a H. Chapman, a non-Cuban H. Chapman. But uh, Alex has written here, even though it, say, it says Habano, my tobacco says it's only Cuban seed and not a Cuban cigar. So that's obviously Cuban seed that's been taken to Dominican Republic or uh, or or wherever, uh, Nicaragua. I don't know where this is going. I'll do some research. I always. I always say I do research, and then I do the research, find out for myself, but never share it. But I'm gonna get better than that. <laughs> I'm gonna get better at that. And then also this, what is this? I can't, sorry Alex. Sorry Alex, I can't read it. This is a Podomo Habano, Connecticut. So it's obviously a Connecticut wrapper. But that is a, that is a good sized cigar. That is a good sized cigar. So anyway, uh, Alex, thank you very much for the, uh, I'll email you mate, you'll get the email before this video, but thank you very much for the cigars man, I really appreciate it, and I'm going to be shooting you over one of these caps, one of these caps for sure man, for sure, hopefully you wear baseball caps, I realise that there's plenty of people out there that don't wear them, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm totally psyched, thank you very much my man. How are we doing? Oi, oi, oi. <laughs> Roll, Chris Robson, TRC. We're out on a night out, <laughs> and we're going to uh, the den. We are. It's Hi, Jordan. So. Say hello, hello Jordan. Yo. <laughs> to, to all 67. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's smashing it. You don't know about... Oh, easy. <laughs> you don't know about Holy Smokes, man. He's going to teach me about cigars, and I'm actually really looking forward to it. Chris Robson. Uh, Chris Robson lifestyle. We're about to turn him into a cigar aficionado. Apparently so. Yeah. This is going to be... It's going to go one of two ways. <laughs> Oh. You'll have to excuse me, I'm a little bit hungover. Went out last night. Um, went out last night in London with a couple of friends. Didn't get back until about half three or four o'clock this morning. And um, a few too many gin and tonics. Uh, but it was very cool. But so um, I'm going. I'm 
I tried to actually tried to get into a cigar bar in Soho, which is a really cool little cigar joint, but it was um, it was full. There was no space, so um, ended up just drinking. I don't drink a lot. Um, I, I say that all the fucking time, but like I've done videos where I'm talking about boozing, so maybe I do drink more than I say I do. But um, we're going back out again in London tonight for my mate Jordan's birthday, and uh, we're going up the Shard for dinner at Obelix, which is a restaurant up the Shard. I've been to the Shard before on my birthday with my girlfriend for breakfast, and it's really, really cool. And so um, I'm gonna take you with me and hopefully get some footage because it's really cool. So, uh, and hopefully, uh, sorry, hopefully uh, I won't look like fucking shit like I do right now, sorry. Okay, cool. Birthday boy. <laughs> we're, at, we're at the shard for dinner. <laughs> you cheated anyway. Dante cheats. It's snowing. We woke up this morning and it snowed. Well, luckily, brain filmed that. Luckily, we own a 4x4. It's in full high. <laughs> and everyone said when I got this truck, a petrol 4x4. Uh, I just want to say a big thank you to everyone that's ordered one of the uh, one of the snapbacks already. So I've had a few orders already and uh, I really appreciate it. Um, I will be putting up uh, a big cartel shop with some of the other stuff that I've got coming soon where you'll be able to grab the hats but a few people have already hit me up on uh, inst on Instagram and uh, all the hats are going out um, I'm doing a load tomorrow morning so that might be in the next video but I really appreciate um, all the support and you know it's such it's such a little thing, you know, there's just, you know, I, I only get a few views on each of the videos. I've only done a little bit, you know, and uh, these are just, it's just a fucking baseball cap, right? But the people who have ordered some, like, I really appreciate your support. I won't forget who you are. Thank you very much, man.